What's up everybody? Okay, so you know when you get down to the beach and you gotta take those pole holders, those PVC or metal ones, you gotta drive them into the ground. Well, last week when I made that video of David Miller driving those PVC poles into the ground, it kind of went crazy and a lot of people was asking me about how did he suck those PVC rod holders down into the ground that fast. A lot of people didn't believe it was real. A lot of people didn't really even think that uh, it was possible. And I mean, honestly, I don't even know how to talk about this with a straight face. <laughs> this is like one of those subjects when you're talking about these, you just don't know how to say it without like people saying you're trying to be crazy or perverted or something. I mean, I'm really trying to talk about this in a very professional way. I just don't know how to do it. But on this video, we're gonna talk about how when you get down there, and you're trying to suck those things down into that, that really hard, uh, wet sand right there by the edge of the beach. How to do that trick. I'm gonna try to explain it to you guys. I don't even know what to name it because I don't wanna be like, I have some crazy name. A lot of you guys like messaged in a lot of names. And I haven't really decided on one, but I think we might decide on one in this video. So in this video guys, we're gonna talk about that surf rod holder sucking down in the ground trick. Here we go. Alright, so what I'm about to show you is probably the coolest surf fishing trick I've ever seen. It's literally, he's literally going to take the pole holder and suck it down into the ground and the hard part of the sand. This is pretty cool. I've never seen anybody do this before. Check this out. So David's gonna show us a trick of how to get these pole holders down in the sand real fast. What? That's nuts. How'd you do that? You just suck the air out of it and pulls the water up just, into it and just goes right down So in. you suck the in? You just suck it. That's pretty cool. Do it again. That's nuts. What is that called? I don't know, an old French. You don't have a name for it? No. So that was not any type of film trick. I didn't even cut the film. It, the pole holder just went down. He was basically sucking the air out of the pole. That was pretty cool. So the trick to this whole pole holder trick, still haven't come up with a name, is that you gotta put it in the wet sand and you got to suck the air, which kind of like lets the sand and water pull up the pipe as, as the, the pole goes down into the sand. Okay, like full disclosure guys, I tried this yesterday and I didn't really get it down into the, the, the sand where the water was coming up, and it's really hard to do. You're gonna wind up getting a mouthful of sand like I did right here. <laughs> Don't try that <laughs> But after like trying over and over, we figured it out. David gave us a few pointers and you get it down into the sand where the water is, the, 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 the sand is really compact and you stick it down in there as far as you can stick it and then you, pull, you, you suck the air out of the, the PVC pipe and the PVC pipe goes down into the ground and it'll go down there and it'll get really sturdy rock and roll. <laughs> Keep sucking. Yeah. So that is really the full synopsis of this surf PVC rod holder. If you know the scientific name of that, comment down below. I think somebody put in there like liquid liquidification or there's like a soil trick. I, Somebody said something in the comment section. I really didn't understand it. I'm not a, like a soilologist or a geologist or anything. So I uh, need some help on this, guys. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. I want, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I want you to comment down below with the name for this trick, the surf PVC 
pole rod holder trick into the ground. If you comment down below with the name, and the name that gets the most likes that's not perverted, I'm gonna name it that. Because it hasn't been named yet, it doesn't have a real name. But I hope you guys like this video. I tried to be as professional, but make it as fun as possible. Without, this is tough, okay? This is a tough subject. So don't forget to comment down below with your name. Comment, like, share. Also guys, I got David Miller to start a YouTube channel. I got him to start one. I yelled at him until he did. So I'm gonna link that down below in the description box, his new YouTube channel name. Hopefully I'll post something. He better post something. I'm gonna link it. And don't forget to like me on Facebook too and Instagram, Yak Motley. See you later, out.